So let's compare Intel's Core i5 i7 dash 4810MQ with i7 dash 4710MQ. Both of them are Intel's high-end notebook processors, kind of a desktop replacements. Both of them are quad-core processors. They have hyper-threading enabled. So especially in the cases where the processors can make use of all the cores, four cores simultaneously. It's, it's very good in performance. Um, the 4810MQ is of course the top of the line as in August 2014 when we are doing this video. It's a 300 MHz more than 4710MQ both in the base clock as well as the turbo clock. So you can see a corresponding increase in the past market score of 700 points, roughly 10% improvement in the performance. The integrated graphics is about the same and they have about the same uh, TDP rating. And so let's take also a look at their comparison. On so basically it shows uh, the Pretty much we cover all of those things. The frequency differences of 300 megahertz. Of course, 4810 MQ is going to be come more competitive, more uh, expensive in price. If 4810 MQ is better in graphics in terms of its max dynamic clock frequency, about 150 megahertz. It does not, not make or break something or be noticeable, but slightly better from the specification wise and from the perspective of taking the uh, data of which one is fair faster. So that's pretty much of it. I hope you, uh, you like this video. Please leave your comment in the comment section below. Thank you.